Okay, guys. So this dude here, J God of YouTube, he made a, a pretty good video. He like you know took his time and tried to provide facts, information to disprove how I'm under the impression that people like Korean Savage and other uh, big time gameplay gamers like Mark of J, maybe Dismo. I don't know. I don't really watch his stuff because you know he's not really on my radar because I don't I don't mind him and like swag. But like Korean Savage is on my radar and um, Mark of J and how. In my opinion, they're somehow in some way cheating to achieve these ridiculous gameplays. And actually, we're going to get into this here real quickly here. How this video that he made, this guy right here made, actually proves my point even further so that I believe they're cheating. Okay. Where is it? 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 Where? Just stay with me here, guys. We're, it's it's going to get good. It's going to get really good. It's going to get spicy here. We're going to throw some memes. We're going to we're going to throw some shade, and uh, we're going to destroy some uh, people's uh, souls. Just crush them. Um. All right. Here it is. Okay. Good. We got that. We're set up here. Okay. So first of all, I want to point out the fact that these kids are morons. Like, I'm sorry, you're morons. A lot of you really shouldn't be on the internet. A lot of you should more so probably be... Let me get some more light here so you can see my sexuality and awesome uh, alpha male face. That's better. Because, like, if, if, first of all, if you really believe this tweet that Korean Savage paid this guy who doesn't really have a relevant YouTube channel per se, like, it's okay, right? Like, he does pretty well. I mean, uh, he's, I'm not trying to throw any shade at him. He does a good job. You know, he gets solid views and whatnot. You know, 10,000, sometimes 30, you know? So it's not bad, right? But, like, it's not alpha male enough. It's not elite level, top notch, super elite, Call of Duty G Fuel, 10% discount code entering, amazing channel like mine. And, like, you know, the views and stuff aren't enough. So, like, you're not going to pay some guy with only, like, 70,000 subscribers getting, you know, maybe 20,000, 30,000 views at best, usually around 5,000 views, to disprove an amazing Call of Duty elite gaming, much more so than Call of Duty in general. YouTuber, just, you know, and, and like this kid here, first of all, you're an idiot. And I mean, like, just, just look at these idiots in general. Like, look at this guy. Look, look, look at this kid. Like, this kid doesn't follow me. So this isn't a sarcastic, you know, cynical tweet. Like, this guy literally believes, like, I'm being honest. Like, bro, bro, what's that meme? Like, you know, there's the joke. Where is it? Okay, so you kids can really honestly go pound sand. You're morons. Seriously, just please. That's the problem with the internet, right? It gives a voice to every idiot out there. And look, at it even got five likes. Everyone who liked this, honestly, you played yourself. You're losers. I'm sorry. So subscribe to my channel and just admit the fact I'm the best. Anyways, back to Jay God here. And this is where it gets important to prove why his video, in fact, actually proves. Proves without re with, with reasonable doubt with reasonable doubt i don't know if we can convict, convict these cheaters in the court of law i don't think i don't know if we can get that prosecuted I don't know if the crown would actually push charges all the way and a, someone a, and a jury would find it guilty i mean obviously a, a jury would not find them guilty because we got kids like this out here who you know who don't understand jokes and are mentally challenged and there's nothing wrong with being mentally challenged but it's just it's it's just best that you just don't participate online when you have mentally you know recessive genes like you're just you're a loser so just stay off the internet but jay god here nothing wrong against that guy he's a good dude it seems like i don't know him personally he could be freaking you know selling drugs to minors at high schools after you know to help supplement his youtube channel i don't know nothing about him you don't know nothing about me either i could be a horrible person in real life or i could be an amazing human being like i am but what i want to get to and the point well, we don't need that on there but the point i want to get to and why 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 this video shows that Korean Savage is in fact cheating. I, I almost, I mean, like, like I said, nothing's provable. This is all just hyperbole. This is all just like, you know, accusations. This is just my opinion. That's why it's called the Eight Thoughts Channel. That's why it's called the Alpha Male Omega Super Elite Johnny Sins Hudson Stunt Double Ridiculously Attractive, Ridiculously Amazing Gamer. First of all, my kills ratio, that's on console. I don't even try on console. I've been messing around with it. I don't. I hate the game of Call of Duty Black Ops 4. It's the lowest KD I've ever had in my life. So for all you dorks out there who think having a high KD actually gets you women, it doesn't. All these guys are ugly, and their girlfriends are ugly. Mine is very attractive, very nice, beautiful, and my KD sucks. Plus, I'm making an actual winner, and things are important, like being a really good basketball player, being really good at making love, being really good at riding my dirt bike. I mean, do you want to see footage of that? You probably do. I'm a star, the cock of gold, super sexual. Well, if you step to this, I will destroy all your rectals. I'm the greatest lover and basketball player. 
Make sure to like this video and don't be a motherfucking hater. This is where we actually get to the point now of how J God's video actually proves that these guys are cheating without doubt. Now I need you to actually to think for a second here. He cites information that if they were cheating and using aim bots or using like some kind of hack or whatnot, then why is that their percentage of aim is the same? Why is everyone's the same? That's really interesting, right? So right away, well, first of all, right away, I don't know why that guy's even in here. I mean, like that guy's one of the biggest losers in the Call of Duty community. And, and the fact that he has more subscribers than I do really hurts my feelings. In fact, most of these guys shouldn't even have anywhere near as many subscribers as I do. They're all just like beta male super dorks with like K3. Like Korean Savage is like a five foot four big headed Korean guy that like I have no idea how he even knows how to turn his PlayStation on in the morning and even like be able to, you know, get through the main menus to play a video game. The guy's like completely and utterly an idiot. Um, Dismo, I don't know. I think that's prestigious keys, brother. And Swag, I don't know. He's a black dude. He's got red hair, so that's very confusing. And J-God, like I said, he seems like a pretty solid dude. But the point is, ladies and gentlemen, is that the percentages, here's the percentage. Like This is like the whatever, your accuracy. It's all the same. I mean, I got the same accuracy as freaking K3. And this is on PlayStation 4. On PC, I don't know what it is. It doesn't matter. The fact is, is that it's pretty much all the same. I don't use these weapons. I never even use Switchblade. I don't know how I have that 20% of it. That's just from picking the gun up. I don't even play with it. But he's trying to show that the averages are all the same. And that, like, uh, these people who cheat who are really bad at the game, their, their stats are horrible. They, they cheat, they be good. But that's not the point. These guys are definitely good at the game. Okay, I don't know about right away. Like I said, in K3, they, these guys are all probably really good at the game to begin with. Like, they're better than me for sure. Because I don't play Call of Duty most of the time. Because playing Call of Duty is for losers, let's be honest. Like, I've you know, smashed my head in with a baseball bat and a hammer while snorting methamphetamines up my bunghole than have to, you know, endure playing Black Ops 4 anymore. But these guys are all really good at the game. Well, like I said, besides right away, like, I, and I don't know who these people are, but like this guy K3, the uh, Asian who proves that the stereotype of all Asians are smart wrong, is very good. Dismo, I don't know. I don't know. I don't, I don't watch them. Uh, Mark of J, really good. He, even though he's like the Kawhi Leonard of Call of Duty and <laughs> very awkward, very nerdy, very serious and has a sense of humor and jokes uh, level of a autistic kid who happens to, you know, maybe be born prematurely. So the point is, is that all these percentages here are showing what his proof is that they don't cheat because they've got the same as me. Now here is the Eureka moment, kids and mongoloids and people with IQs of 50 who don't understand satire, sarcasm, jokes and take the stuff seriously and probably think, uh, you know what, like I'm a loser and not realizing that I'm the, probably the greatest YouTuber and um, uh, just human being probably on this platform. And you know what, not all heroes wear capes. Some are bald and uh, very attractive, but if that's the case, then what is separating people? This does not show what is separating skill then. That is really the meat and potatoes here. Like I'm actually gonna get serious for a second and probably 90% of you whose attention spans are shorter than Korean Savage's height probably already left this video and didn't even bother taking time to watch it. And that's cool. I mean like, you know what? You're gonna be a loser and probably work at Walmart as a greeter when you retire because you don't have a good job, didn't get a pension and probably have no, you know, savings. So, you know, when I walk up in there and you're the greeter at Walmart because I'm gonna live to be about 150 because I'm just like that, that physically uh, gifted, um, I'm going to make sure to, uh, you know, cause you a lot of grief and trouble and remind you that this is why I'm the best and you're a loser. But if you're using this stat to prove that people are better than other people, but everyone has the same percentages going across, then this would not be a good measure of actual skill and who's better and who's not. Because if this was what you would use to measure skill, then there is no skill gap here. So obviously there's something else going on here that would showcase why these guys are so much better than everyone else. Because if I have the same accuracy as K3, Korean Savage, across the board pretty much, I mean, I don't use a Titan because that's a sweaty noobs. I don't use a Switchblade because I don't, you know, play the game enough to unlock it and, you know, buy guns and try to hype up COD points and, uh, you know, sell my soul to Activision for a few bucks while destroying the Call of Duty community itself like the rest of these losers on this list besides me. Mark of J, I don't know what he does. Like I said, I, he's a black dude and I really don't want to go after them because that would be really against the rules of the internet right now. And uh, as a white male... I can't really say anything disparagingly about a black male because, you know what, 
equality. But besides Mark of J, the Kawhi Leonard of Call of Duty, the rest of these losers can go pound sand. And then this guy, J God, who seems like a nice guy, I'm going to like your video, can go pound sand as well because this right here is not a measurement of skill because otherwise we'd all be the same. So something else is going on here. That's all I'm saying. Something else is going on. The percentage of the, their hit detection, their, whatever their accuracy shouldn't count because we've all got the same. So what is what is separating him from me as being a sweaty, try hard, five foot four, big headed Korean nerd and me being a six foot six, 255 pound alpha male, elite gaming, athletic stud, muffin, motocross, dirt bike riding, professional love making with an above average size, you know, uh, than, uh, than, 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 you know, him. Like, so, you know what, you know, I don't know. So, J God, try again. You failed. I'm the best. I'm the greatest. These sons of bitches right here are all a bunch of cheating bastards and suck the cod, you know. I can't say it because I don't want to bother re-editing this video because I'm too lazy today and I just want to drink my orange juice with vodka. Kick my feet up and watch the Toronto Raptors beat the hell out of the Golden State Warriors today. Hopefully. Hopefully Kate Clay Thompson isn't really healthy. But more importantly, the takeaway from this video is that I'm the best. Once again, I'm, I've been proven right. Um, most of these kids on here, um, you guys are morons if you don't understand these jokes like this. You know, like this kid. You're an idiot, Adam. Um, that other kid, whatever his name is, you're, you're a moron too. You probably should follow me on Twitter. Make sure you follow me on Twitter right here. Eight thoughts, eight thoughts, seven, um, 6,000 followers. I had, you know, you should follow me on that. Also check out my YouTube channel. You might want to, uh, check that out. This is my second channel right here, guys. Nine thoughts on the champion as well. And I get quite a lot of views on that as well. More so than other people's channels. And I don't even try. I just upload stupid videos with 35,000 subscribers. And this is my main channel. That you probably wish to subscribe to that's eight thoughts. Um, I get a hell of a lot of views on this one. View to sub ratio is, uh, pretty freaking badass. That's all I'm going to say. Pretty awesome. I, I, you know, like it's when you're the best, uh, people are going to hate on you because they aren't the best. And that pretty much it seems to be the case across the board. I'm a champion and, uh, haters are going to hate. Thanks for watching the video. Subscribe. Follow me on Twitter. Um, don't forget to check out my Twitch channel as well. There's eight thoughts. Um, maybe you want to buy some merch if you guys get a chance to come and check out my amazing merch store. This is it right here, eight thoughts store on Teespring. I got some pretty funny stuff. Uh, there's some Gucci thoughts. Um, there's just like you know the hater, like 90% of you dumbass kids. There's me with my 12 gauge shotgun that uh, I'm pretty good and proficient with. Um, there's some you know the Conor McGregor mug shot. Pretty good shirts. You might want to check them out. They're not really reasonably priced because this website's a ripoff. But you know what? Hey, think about supporting me. Subscribe. That's Pint Master Broda. He follows me. I got a lot of people following me. Anyways, um, take it easy, everybody. Jay God, he follows me too. And uh, this guy here, I don't know who he is, but that dude there is uh, questionable. All right. Drifter out. I wish I was like a thoughts. He's the best in the world. And he does. Sad.